Yo, good morning guys. So as you guys all know, at the moment, there's a very unique situation happening where most things are closed, snowboarding, a lot of stores, restaurants. So there's not a ton to do, but it is a good idea to get outside, to get some exercise, to um, enjoy the outdoors. It's a beautiful day here in Whistler. So I'm gonna take you guys around my neighborhood and stop in on some of my neighbors. So we're gonna find some other snowboarders in the neighborhood to do a short hike with. Let's go find them. Oh, Poochie. Oh, hello. Pooch. Should I let her out? Yeah, no, no, no. You put in the subtitles like, get me out of this dang car. <laughs> Yo, Chris, what's up, man? What's going on, man? How's it going? Hope you guys are staying safe out there. How's things? No snowboarding? No snowboarding, no, just hiking at the moment. You wanna keep it down back there a little bit? <laughs> yeah, just trying to hike and stay safe. <laughs> Make sure this dog gets some exercise. <laughs> Man, she's crazy. All right, come on. What have you been doing the last few weeks? Uh, yeah, a uh, bit of snowboarding before obviously everything's been shut down. <laughs> Taking it. <laughs> Long distance elbow tap. Hey Kevin. Andreas, long distance elbow tap. Wow. <laughs> oh yeah. Cheek to cheek, long distance kiss. <laughs> <laughs> David, so what are you doing in Whistler, man? What was your original plan? Well, I wasn't even meant to be here right now. I was meant to be in Utah, then I was meant to go to Colorado, then Whistler. And I was meant to be here until mid-May. Mid what? But now I'm leaving. I'm leaving tonight. So uh, yeah, yeah. That's my last morning here. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna really miss snowboarding with you this spring. But oh yeah. We'll just put it like yeah, we'll just push it back a little bit. If it reopens, I might come back. Who knows? <laughs> Perfect. Now, Andres, what's happening in your life? I know that Comor is shut. What's yeah, that man. like? Well, Comor shut down for the first time in a long time. I'm not working, which means I just have more time to hang out and go hiking and chill with the likes of people like yourself. Any plans for the next few months? Well, I have a lot of videos still to backlog edit. You know, I've got a lot of footage from the winter. I still have footage from Japan I have to yeah, get to. Yeah, footage from before Japan. Yeah, I've got footage <laughs> from before Japan that I still have to edit. So, you know, there's gonna be a bunch of videos coming out from me. They'll just sort of be from back in time. Yeah. As they should be. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right guys, so we're gonna do a snowy hike up here at the top of our street. Coincidentally, we all live in the same neighborhood, which is good for hikes and, and but overall camaraderie. Yeah, for the camaraderie. It's a cool hike. It's been in a few videos. We've built some backcountry rail rails up in here. Chris, you know this hike better than anyone. Dude, I know this hike. What's the what's, and out. what's the standout of this hike? You can hike up to the top of Rainbow Mountain. It's a seven and a half hour, 23 kilometer loop. Whoa. 14 miles. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, it's sick. You go all the way up through the Alpine, zigzagging around, going all crazy up to the peak, and then you come back down on another side, like through the the drainage valley. Come oh. out with the drainage. Nice. <laughs> yeah. And Dot must love this hike too. Where is she? I have Dot. Idea. Dot. Oh, uh, she's, she's up here. You got it, Chris. Oh, oh. oh no! What? <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. That was close. David, it's even smaller now. Yes! Yes, you got it. Oh, we're getting the snowballs. <laughs> we're about halfway through the hike. Pretty much the whole way is walking on snow, which is making it a little bit more difficult. Uh, you guys may be wondering where TJ is. He actually left a few days ago to get back to the States. 
He wanted to be in America, like on that side of the border. He's got some family in North Carolina, so if he needs to get to his family, I think it's much easier for him to get there from the States than being up here in Canada. Yeah. What's happening in New Zealand? So when you go back? I have to quarantine for 14 days, so I think I'm just gonna chill in my room and edit. Oh. Yes. That's why I haven't edited anything. I've been saving it for when I don't have nothing to do. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, we'll have to do some Instagram lives together or something. Oh, okay. That'd be pretty I fun. I don't know, Kevin, I'm afraid of going live. <laughs> I hear a call of the wild. <laughs> Chris, you have some family in Horseshoe Bay in Vancouver, right? Yeah, so Horseshoe Bay is just uh, between Whistler and Vancouver. Yeah. And I got a lot of my family there and then my other family in London. And your parents are older, right? They're they're getting up there, so they're self-quarantining? They're old. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, they're totally self-quarantining. Andreas, what's the leading conspiracy theory on the... The leading conspiracy... <laughs> There's no way that you'll even put this on your channel. It'll be way too... Uh... You need to go for the tamest leading conspiracy. Yeah, the tamest. The short, short form version of what's happening on the podcast. I think Andreas so... doubted it. That's my conspiracy. I believe that there's a conspiracy to stop all of us snowboarders, you know? They started this thing because they saw me having way too much fun, and they're like, not today, Andreas. I think that's the Church of Snowboardology actually started this virus because they're going to somehow profit off of it. I think that they were worried about the, you know, the Church of Snowboardology taking off and then everybody quitting their jobs anyway and just going snowboarding all the time. Yeah, no, that's more believable actually. That's probably it. They were fearful of my, what do they, what do you call that? A, revo a revolution. <laughs> they were afraid of my revolution. <laughs> kind of like a John it. Lennon figure over here. You yeah, know? nice shirt, dude. That shirt look, looks familiar. Yeah, man. Such a sick graphic, dude. Look, it's got everything that's like Andreas esque. You look kind of ridiculous, Andreas. Well, there's. <laughs> Thanks, David. Thanks. <laughs> All right, guys, so we've made it to our destination, to the lookout over Whistler. <laughs> oh, nice. So we got Black Hill Mountain right here, Whistler on this side, Green Lake. Our neighborhood is down in this area. Whistler at the moment is pretty much a ghost town. There's almost, uh, there's almost nobody left. All right, we gotta get going. David's gotta catch his flight. That's right. Dude, have a safe trip, man. Thank you. Best wishes in New Zealand. Thanks. How's the flight gonna be? You think you're gonna be solo or are you gonna be stuck there with like... Um, I feel like I'm gonna be... The plane's gonna be full of a bunch of New Zealanders and Australians. Yeah. So, yeah, probably very busy. Do you have a mask? No. Nah. <laughs> no. You're good. <laughs> well, have a safe flight, dude. Thank you. Long distance elbow tap. And in the same time in California. Definitely go back to Bear next season. We need to go back to Bear. <laughs> we do. We do. All right. <laughs> All right, boys, shall we? So we shall. <laughs> Cool, so that was our hike here in Whistler. It'd be awesome to hear it from you guys in the comments, some of the stuff that you guys have been up to, and also let me know what videos you guys wanna see in the future. We'll also be doing some more live chats this week, so hit the subscribe button and turn the no notifications on so that you get notified when I go live. But until then, guys, hope you guys all stay safe and hope you're staying active and having a, having a good time through this uh, bit of a crisis that the world's going through so yeah be safe out there guys thanks again for watching and we'll see you guys again next time here from whistler later
Mwah. 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 Mwah.